What up, what up, what up? Welcome back to our channel, guys. I'm Rod. I'm here with my dad. Rod Senior. And we are Bridging, Bridging the, the Gap. Gap. Yes, yeah, sir. The boys is back with another fire reaction video for you. If you enjoy our reaction videos, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Also, drop a comment and let us know what we should react to next. Turn on your post notifications so you're notified every single time you drop hey. a new video. And if you like our videos, but you want to see the uncut, unedited versions, then make sure you check out our Patreon. The link is in the description. Okay, it's the moment you've all been waiting for. This is Ye, Kanye West, track one, I Thought About Killing You. Oh, okay. And this is produced by Andy C., Aaron Lammer, Mike Dean, Benny Blanco, Francis and the Lights, and Kanye West. How many, you know, how you even coming up with conversations say, hey, you know, by the way, I, I thought about killing you. You're going to see right here. <laughs> oh, yeah, and then what do you think about <laughs> the, the album hell? cover? I hate being bipolar. It's awesome. Uh, you hate being bipolar, but it's awesome? That's a, you seem like you <laughs> contradicting yourself there. You hate being bipolar. It's awesome. But it's awesome. Yeah. Okay. What do you think about the artwork behind the words? It's like some, you know, some um, mountain ranges with some snow on top of it. But that's the desert. That's the desert. That's uh, Jackson Hole, Wyoming. Oh, Okay. Uh, I believe this photo was taken by Kanye West outside. He's got of, a place there. Outside of his car, uh, he was driving and he took it. Well, yeah, he's he's got a big. Uh, don't he have a big ranch there or something there? Yeah, it's pretty amazing. Um, there was a lot of footage of all the artists going to Jackson Hole mm. and recording, just like uh, kind of when we we talked about Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy. All the mm. artists would go to Hawaii and record when right. he was doing that. Yep, yep. Uh, he's been recording this current album. He's about to drop uh, in uh, the Middle East somewhere and like the middle of the desert or a really cool resort. So he's always... Yeah, he better be careful for the middle. He's messing around getting kidnapped over there. <laughs> then he'll come back when he get away. And they let him come back to the United States after about eight, nine, ten years after he lock his butt up. <laughs> and then he'll come back. Hey, look, he would have a whole bunch of new yeah, material. Man, for sure. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my God. Okay. All right, we'll get right into it. Uh, I thought about killing you. Track one. Oh, man. Yeah, but damn, I thought I just want to let you know. I thought about killing your butt. I really did. <laughs> uh oh, nice vocals to start out with. Is that? That's Francis and the lights. Thoughts are always besides the darkest. Thoughts are always besides the darkest. He sounds like he's on a bad trip or something. Man, you know? I think this is the part where I was supposed to say something like to he's... compensate it so it doesn't come off in a bad place. Bad. And he's having this bad trip. Or something, yeah. You know? But sometimes I think really bad things. Really, really, mm -hmm. really bad things. See? Well, you was, you was on some kind of hallucinogen. And I love myself way more yeah. than and I love to you. This? <laughs> You'd be freaking out. You know? <laughs> See, if I was trying to relate it to more people, I'd probably say I'm struggling with loving myself because that seems like a common thing. <laughs> of course. But that's not the case here. You. I love myself way more than I love you. And I think about killing myself. So best believe, I thought about killing That's you contradictory, today. you know? Premeditated, bro. I called up my loved ones. I called up my cousins. I called up the Muslims. Said I'm about to go dumb. Get so bright it's no sun. Get so loud I hear none. I don't do shit halfway. I'ma clear the cachet. I'ma make my name last. Put that on my last name. It's a different type of rules that we obey. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Season, nigga, we obey. We was all born to die, nigga, D-O-A. Niggas nice say they hero. Yeah. Mm, I don't sure. see no cake. Nice. Mm, I don't Real see good. no, yeah. Mm, yeah. <laughs> I don't see no, mm, mm. If I wasn't shining so way back to when I had the braids and you had the wave cap. Drop a pimp and fade <laughs> and I'm on my way, hey, stop. Yeah. Don't get sacked in the map, you know, homie, don't play. Don't get your tooth chip like Frito Lay. <laughs> Don't get your chip. Don't get your tooth chip like Frito Lay. That's clever. All right, that's track number one. I thought about killing you. Uh, okay. Um, okay. Um, let's how, how I'm gonna put this. Yeah. Uh, technically speaking, um, 
it was it was well it was a well crafted well put together song mm -hmm. um the, the uh, production was really really good me personally though i mean if i was going to download this uh, this play on my play you know this album on my playlist yeah that this kind of song kind of makes me just kind of puts me in a bad mood kind of like yeah. you know what i mean it's yeah. kind of dark yeah, yeah so to me i would probably i probably even though it's a great song I know it's a great song. It would make my playlist because I'd be wanting to hear this. <laughs> you know what I mean? He talking about I love myself. <clears throat> what you say? He 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 loves himself way more than he loves you. But he was thinking about killing himself. Well, that was kind of contradictory to me. So I mean, so I mean, like I said, and the music sounded dark and kind of like he was like on a bad trip or something. Same thing. That's the that's kind of the, the vision I got. He's like on. You know, not really a bad trip, but just like in a really bad, uh, dep in a depressed mood. Yeah. And so this is what this song kind of jumps out to me and gives me that kind of feeling. He was in, in a depressed mood. And this is what he was feeling. And he was he just put it, you know, put it into words. Now the bars was just killer, man. And he had that little part where he was like, way back. Yeah. And back. <laughs> yeah. And back. I like that, that part was right fire. there. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, it was a uh, uh, the flow to the song was uh, kind of. Uh, odd to me yeah because when it first started out it was kind of like a real slow and it had this funny looking these sound effects yeah, yeah, yeah. And, i mean but that was all a part of bringing you into his world yeah you know making you know because he was depressed and he wanted you to feel that for sure so he he mission accomplished on that uh yeah so we'll go ahead and roll to the uh, second track this is track number two this is yikes and this is uh -oh. uh, featuring... That title even gives you a... Uh, uh, <laughs> okay, what's getting ready to happen? Yikes! Yikes. <laughs> uh, this is produced by Pierre Bourne, mm -hmm. Mike Dean, Apex Martin, Mike Dean. and Kanye West. Track number two, Yikes. Shit could get menacing, frightening, fine help. We've seen Pierre Sometimes Bourne before, too. I scare mm -hmm. myself, myself. Shit could get... Menacing, frightening, find help. Sometimes I scare myself, myself. Tweaking, tweaking off that 2CB high. Is he going to be I don't know. Thought I was going to run what? DMC high. Probably drunk I didn't try to live again on DMT high. See, this is the type of high that won't come down. Find help. Sometimes I scare Myself, myself, shit could get menacing, frightened, but I'm really not. You know how many girls I took to the titty shop? Mm -hmm. And she get the ass with it, that's a 50 pop. I still bring the bad bitches in the city, yeah. Uh, just a different type of leader. We could be in North Korea. I could smoke a whisker, leave a uh. Ooh. Told my okay. wife I never seen her after I hit it by Felicia. That's the way that I'm a shit could get. <laughs> Menacing. See, this is why all the bitches fuck with you, fuck what they talk about. Sometimes I they scare take me on myself, mass, off mass, myself. ask yourself. Shit could no. get menacing, frightening. Ask your whole girl right now. Look, you had a shot at yay. Sometimes I scare no. myself, you try everything. myself. Tweaking, tweaking up. That's why I fuck with yay. See, that's my third part. That's my bipolar shit. <laughs> That's my superpower, person. nigga. Ain't no disability. I'm a superhero. <laughs> I'm a superhero. That's how you gotta look at that. That's how you gotta look at it. Everybody All gonna tell right. you crazy. You know I ain't. I'm a superhero. Yeah. Stop hate. Yeah. yeah. Track yeah. number two, yikes. What Get with the program. <laughs> um, it, it, mad bars, man. Yeah. Mad bars. Um, you know, when I was listening to the song, though, it had so many highs in it. And I thought, I said, dang, I wonder if... Uh, how how it, this song could have been like a much uh, um, hard hitting song if like you added some eight oh eights and some snares in it. Mm. You know, it was da, very, da, 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 da. it was a very it's sparse beat. For right, sure. right. Yeah, yeah. So if it had and you had some little parts where you had some eight oh eights and you hear some boom boom. Yeah, you know, like yeah, and that, yeah, that would have yeah. made it pop to me. For sure. So for sure. that's that's my advice to you, Kanye, uh. and, and uh, I am. Uh, <laughs> Driver's license, <laughs> the producer. <laughs> Give me your credentials, Pop. Yeah. This nigga's dope, man. <laughs> yeah, Very yeah. Fact. All right, we'll go ahead and move to the next track. Uh, this is one of my favorite tracks over here. This is titled All Mine. Mm -hmm. 
This is uh, produced by Francis and oh, the some Lights. More, some more vocals, huh? Yep. Uh, Mike Dean, Mike Rob Dean. Scott, or Robot Scott, and Kanye West. All right, cool. <coughs> Excuse me. Track number three, All Mine. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a nice start. Yeah, you supermodel with it. Then the last person at the bottom. Oh. I'ma lose my mind in it. Crazy, I'ma do a obligato. Get the rubbing on my lap. Get the chili out the bottom. This, this, the beginning up. catches your attention right yeah. off the bat. Pipe up, I'm a pipe up. Make your mind out and fat it up. Choose your thing. Make that pussy sing. One more time. Make what? it do it, babe. Make it cry. Come on, who this shit? Gonna be an enormous scandal. I could have my lying. homie Campbell. And still might want me a Stormy Daniels. Whoa. Sometimes you gotta bag the boss up. I call that ticket Corey Gambles. Find yourself up in the food court. You might have to enjoy your sample. sample. All these thoughts on Chris and me. Uh. Almost what got Tristan single. Oh, if you don't ball this. like him or Kobe. Guaranteed blunt. I love your titties because they prove I could focus on two things at once. You can prove you focus on two things at once. That's stupid. <laughs> His voice is kicking me out. Aunt Clemens. <laughs> Let me hit it raw like fuck the outcome. Hey, none of us will be here without come. Oh my God. Hey, if it ain't all about that, if I see you pull up that's, with the three stripes, a, hey, I like I'm that. Fuck sound around that. and make yeah. you my bitch. <laughs> Oh, oh, stop. All right, that's track number three, All Mine. What do you think about that? <laughs> to me, that that was like a, a fun song. Yeah, for you know? sure. Definitely the first. It like, definitely had me kind of, you know, you know, just, you know, having a little chuckle. Yeah. But, you know, it's a... Get me out the bottle. What's at the bottom? Yeah. I do a lot of got him. Got him. <laughs> oh my God. That voice was chipping me out, man. But... The beginning of the song, it really catches your attention right off the bat. So, you know, it had this nice little catchy little, you know, this voice and a nice little beat to it. The production was really good. And the, the bars were good. Again, again. Yeah. The boy, he, the boy got some bad bars, man, for real. No, nah, he went crazy. He 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 really went crazy. I like this. <laughs> I like that first verse when he was talking about Kerry, uh, Kerry Washington, Naomi Campbell, uh, uh, Stormy Daniels. <laughs> you know, he was just like, <laughs> and the, the way he... he Intermingle yeah, that, you know. Sure. I was like, oh man, that was cool. Man. That was, <laughs> I was just like, I like that. <laughs> yeah, that was fire. You find crazy. yourself in a food court and you Trying might have enjoyed a sample. sample. <laughs> <laughs> cool, cool. We'll go ahead and move it to the next track. This is track number four. It's titled Wouldn't Leave. And I think this, no, this isn't the first time you've heard Party Next Door. You've heard Party Next Door on Drake albums before. But yeah, here's, uh, here's track number four featuring Party Next Door. And it's produced by Ty Dolla Sign, Mike Dean, Noah Goldstein, and Kanye West. I bet. Here we go. I don't feel that like she's mine enough. God, I feel I couldn't have you wide enough. With a fly in my wrist, you made pretty women out of my skin. Kind of like a and I gospel feel feel like to it. Man, mm-hmm. I know you. They said build your own, I said high sway. I said slavery a choice, they said hi yay now, nah, but she wouldn't and leave. I know you wouldn't so leave. Wow. Okay. Yes, you know, yeah, what it is. We can go on the phone and talk. Right now, that's my favorite. Yeah. Got the bar and the vocals and the rap. Oh, don't bring that up. That's gonna get me sentimental. You know I'm <coughs> sensitive. I got a gentle mental. Every time something happens, they want me sentimental. We had an incident, but I covered incidentals. A, you want oh, me working on my messages. He had already got the controversy. Like He's just addressing it. Like 
Even if publicly I like the empathy yeah. I ain't finna talk about it Another four centuries right. One and one is two of me and you That's infinity that was tight. That was <laughs> tight, man. God, I, I like that. Couldn't have you waiting up. What? Oh, look at this. Oh, oh, harmonies. harmonies. <laughs> and I don't feel like baby. Ever embarrassed they girl. Ever embarrassed they, girl. Ever embarrassed they wife. She told you not to do that shit. She told you you was going to fuck the money up. <laughs> but you ain't want to listen, did you? Keep that same energy. Keep that same energy. Now you testing our loyalty. This is what they mean when they say for better or for worse, huh? you right, right, right. <laughs> she... That is so tight, dude. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one. Hey. That's a beautiful song. The and the and the words, man, they mm. just oh, they they just like they hit home. They they uh, it's heartwarming. It's it's provocative. It's it's colorful. Man, it's all these things, man. It wrapped in this song, man. It was just like a that's 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 a that's a complete song right there. Perfect song. Yeah. It really is. Yeah. Okay, uh, next track is No Mistakes, and this is produced by Shea Pope, Mike Dean, Caroline Shaw, Eric Danchik, and Kanye West. Some more vocals, I'm assuming, with Caroline. Caroline's the vocalist, I'm, I'm assuming. Uh, so, like, yeah. Is she a rapper? I'm she not sure. So, the listener is a produ producer, so I'm not sure uh, oh, okay. if she's going to actually sing. Right. Uh, we are going to get some more guest vocals on here. Here's track mm. number five, No Mistakes. Mm. Charlie Believe Wilson. it or not. Charlie Wilson. Make <laughs> no mistake, girl. I okay. still love you. Make no mistake. That's old school mistake, feel girl, to it. I still love you. Okay. Now we up again. Oh, I like oh. that. I got dirt on my name, I got white on my beard I had dead on my books, it's been a shaky ass year Let me make this clear, so all y'all see I don't take advice from people less successful than me <laughs> Ain't no love that makes love, sense. But the gloves off, and we up in this bitch until they turn the club off Had to tell the dogs, turn the snubs off Plus they are already mad that the Cubs lost uh -oh. These two wrongs are right you I was too grown in high school The true soul of Ice Cube Too close to snipe you Truth told I like you Too, <laughs> too close to, to snipe you. you Too rich to fight you Calm down you light skin Calm down you light skin <laughs> You know what he's talking about? Right, that is track number five. No mistakes. Love it, love it. That was a cool song. It take me. Um, it, it had an old school feel to it, mm -hmm. you know. And really, what this song kind of reminded me of, and I thought to myself, uh, part of this reflected part of his environment, growing up in Chicago, mm -hmm. because I remember uh, in my younger days, of course, um, I used to go to Chicago, bebop around there, and have fun and stuff. And man, the one thing I do remember so vividly to this very day was when you start coming into the city of Chicago and them big old giant buildings hit you and you turn on the radio, they had like five or six soul channels, right? Mm -hmm. R&B channels. Mm -hmm. Man. They was jamming. Boy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. It would blow your mind. You'd be like, damn. These yeah. I mean, they rocking stuff that you don't even... You didn't know it was out there, yeah, but yeah, it was, yeah. and they slamming it every day, you know, like that. And this song kind of remind me, like, yeah, that would be probably a song when I'm driving in Chicago and I hit that radio station and, whoa, yeah. it was on, man. It was uh, on. That's fire. That's yeah. fire. Uh, we'll go ahead and roll to the next track. This is track number six. This is titled Ghost Town. <laughs> oh, Ghost Town. Okay. Drop some ghosts in the <laughs> chat for Ghost Town. Ghost Town. <laughs> This is featuring Party Next Door, Benny Blanco, Francis, and the Lights. Are they going to have power on here, too? Uh, Noah Goldstein, Mike Dean, and Kanye West. Who? Power. Who's power? On, yeah, ghosts on power. Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> it's his town. 
<laughs> they say it is a big big sound. <laughs> I just come from the poet's part. <laughs> hey, nigga, Laura, nigga, baby, I gotta make it. It's where it goes down. Hey. <laughs> that's my joint. Yeah, it is so that's good. a fire song. Mm-hmm. That's a fire intro song. Yeah, it is. I actually need that on my phone. Oh, that's a good I idea. I need that song. That's my joint. That's a, that's I love a good that idea song. to have it on your phone. Yeah. Here's track number six, Ghost Town. <laughs> Mm. Okay, that's good. You want to hit the red dot on everybody? You want to hit the red dot on everybody? That's cold. It'd be like that, though. I've been trying. Oh, pack of fin on Sell those like cigarettes now. <laughs> hey, let me get a pack of fin on that, please. <laughs> Caught between space and time. Mm. This now in mind. Mm-hmm. Maybe someday. Yeah, hey, all right. Trying. Go on, kid, cut it. Yeah. To make you love me. Once again, I am that's good right there. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Listen to that. Listen to that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We're still the kids we used to be. Yeah. Yeah. I put my hand on a stove to see if I still bleed. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. We're still the kids we used to be. Yeah. 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 I put and <laughs> Video game. <laughs> the laser is here. Uh, <laughs> we're still the kids we used to be. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. We're still the kids we used to be. Yeah, yeah. Uh. I put my hand on a stove to see if I still bleed. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, that is Ghost Town featuring Party Next Door 070 Shake. What do you think about that one? Okay, you say it's Ghost Town, but I still don't kind of get the the tie-in. I mean, the song said a whole bunch of different things, so maybe I missed it. I'm not sure. Um, He puts his hands on the stove to see if he still bleeds. Nothing hurts anymore, so he's numb to the world, I guess. I don't know. But Ghost Town is like there's nothing there. He feels like you know he's in a world by itself. Maybe I don't know. Is that what he is that yeah, what he's saying? I could see that. Yeah. Um, so yeah, there is a lot to unpack here. Um, someday I'll wear a starry crown. Is the first sample that comes in, and mm-hmm. someday I want to lay it down. I want to lay down, get rest. <laughs> Remember this on a Sunday, back way. Sometimes I want to hit the red dot on everybody. Mm-hmm. He's I was just, I'm tired. I want to lay lay down and, and rest, but I still got you know work to do, and I got this burning inside of me every day. I'm living living high and doing whatever I want to do. Then Kid Cuddy's chorus comes in. I've been trying to make you love me, but everything I try just takes you further from me. What do you take from that? Oh man, I've been trying to love me. Oh. Wait, wait, say it again. Now. I've been trying to make you love me, but everything, but everything I try just, just takes, takes you, you further from me. Well, apparently he's, you know, nothing he can, nothing he does pleases 
uh, this person, I guess. Um, you know, that's um, typical in some relationships. So he's feeling kind of isolated there, I guess. So that's another um, uh, reference to a ghost town. It's just like he's by himself. I mean, he li he's living in the world, but... It don't seem like nobody's in it but him. Mm. It's a ghost town. Yeah, for sure. I yeah. like it. I like it for sure. Yeah, yeah, he's in this relationship and he's feeling like alone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, then he's got some interesting lyrics. Uh, Baby, don't you bet it all on a pack of fentanyl. <laughs> so, that jumped me out right there. I was like, I don't know why that jumped out to me. A pack, a pack of fentanyl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe buying cigarettes yeah, or something. Yeah, cigarettes. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, it was... Um, that was an interesting song, man. I, I liked it, though. It's, and the outro, mm -hmm. when they had this, you know, huge sort of kind of like crescendo or whatever, <sighs> man, it just, it was, that was <sighs> nice, man. Yeah, 070 made this song. Mm -hmm. 070 Shake, her part where she comes in, and it builds up to I feel like I'm free, mm -hmm. where there's still the kids we used to be. Put my head on the stove to see if I still bleed. Yeah. Oh my god, I get freaking chills, bro! Like that, that climax is amazing. It, it, look, and that's 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 one of those songs, man. You you get to tune in your head, and it'll stay. Oh in yeah, for, a while, for sure. You know what I mean, so yeah. When I played this for the first time, I listened to every single track in order. When I got to track six, mm -hmm. I played that probably. <laughs> eight times I was like what eight like, times yes because I mean from that infectious guitar sample throughout mm. the whole thing and then when that comes to a head in the um in the climax of the song like mm -hmm. bum 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 yeah. bum like yep. what oh yeah. my god just so so powerful it was it uh, was amazing track yeah ghost I town agree. I agree uh <laughs> Oh, no more spoiler alerts. Uh, <laughs> this, I was about to spoil something for the next album uh, that we're about to listen to, but we're okay. about to listen to it. All right. All right. Track number seven is titled Violent Crimes. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, I know he's going to talk crazy. <laughs> yeah. I know this is crazy talk, big time. Yeah. For, for an album to start with, uh, I thought about killing you. Oh, and, that's my boy and, on there. And end with uh, Violent Crimes. Irv. Produced by Irv Gotti, Seven Aurelius, and Kanye West. Track, hmm. track seven, Violent Crimes. Okay. Falling, dreaming, talking in your sleep. I know you want to cry all night. Oh, worry all, oh, it was all part of the story. Even the scary nights, thank you for all of the glory. You will be remembered all. Thank you to all of the heroes of the night. Nice. They gotta repeat the colors. The law is wearing off. Reality is upon us. Colors dripping off. Colors dripping off. Such imagination. Niggas is savage. Niggas is monsters. Niggas is pimps, niggas is players. Roddy, I pray your bodies drink more like mine and not like your mommy's. Just being salty, but niggas is nuts. And I am a nigga, I know what they want. I pray that you don't get it all at once. Curves under your dress, I know it's pervs all on the net. All in the comments, you wanna vomit. That's your baby, you love her to death. Now she cutting class and hanging with friends. You break a glass and say it again. She can't comprehend the danger she in. If you mm -hmm. whip her ass, she moving with him, then he would as you go through it again but how you the devil rebuking the sin let's pray we could put this behind us yeah. i swear that these times is the wildest she That's got the deep, scars man. they yeah. serve as reminders blood still on her pajamas but yesterday is dead story mm. even the scary nights thank you for That's all a deep message right there you will be remembered all thank you to all of the years here ty dollar sign in there uh-huh that's how i'm just gonna really say <laughs> you sound good <laughs> so like some in sync harmonizing there. Yeah. Man, man. They like doing it. I'm thing. saying it like I want a daughter like Nikki. All right, that is track number seven, Violent Crimes. What do you think about that, Dad? That was like word, man. <laughs> you know, he was like, 
He's calling out like he said, you know, we, we play all these different roles in our communities, man. But then you you have a daughter. You don't want them treating your daughter. You know, you don't want your daughter treated like you was out here doing. You mm-hmm. know, that's why he said, I'm the devil calling out the scene. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Because he's been, he's, he been a part of all those things he yeah, was talking about. For sure. You know, so it was a deep message, man. Because when you flip the script and you start thinking about that, you be like, damn, he's right. Right. You know. Yeah, so, I mean, we had a similar conversation. Yeah, for you. sure, <laughs> for <laughs> sure, <laughs> definitely. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, that is uh, track number seven, "Violent Crimes." That concludes Kanye West's eighth studio album. Yay. Yay! What did you think about Yay? Yay! Okay, mixed bag with Yay. Mm. I mean, with this this album, I like. I enjoyed like half the half the music, half the. Uh, I enjoyed all of it. Okay, let let me rephrase it. I enjoyed the whole thing. I have, uh, but uh, as far as selecting something for me personally for my playlist, Mm -hmm. I would probably take half of these songs and and add it to my playlist. The other ones wouldn't make it probably. Just because they don't have enough, you know, bounce or uh, something to it to make me, you know, want to just, unless I'm just in the mood just to listen and sit and just, you know, enjoy the the entirety of the whole album, I probably would just want to hear the parts that... I think I enjoyed it most. Which yeah, is- I th- I think I agree. I, I I've kind of gravitated to about three or four of the songs on mm-hmm. here, and those are in heavy rotation. But the rest of it, I don't really ever just listen to this as a whole, mm-hmm. which is not that bad to do. I mean, it's only seven songs, but right. yeah, I just kind of always go back to those same few, like the lower half of the album. Um, but yeah, I do like this album. I think it gets kind of some uh, unnecessary hate. Really? Yeah, because, I mean, I think people just wanted more. But he told you. But he told us what he was doing. And, you know. Was, well, you were getting more. I mean, if he's dropping, you know, seven um, yeah, album, different yeah. albums, I mean, he is giving you more. I mean, how much more you want him to put on one right. when you're going to get seven? Right. You know, so. So, but, yeah, um, that's yay. I hope you guys are happy <laughs> for yeah. now. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, yay was good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was good. I rock with yay. Um, but yeah, that's all we got for today. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Also, drop a comment. Let us know what we should react to next. Turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time we drop a new uh, video. Excuse me. Mm-hmm. And uh, if you like our videos but you want to see the uncut, unedited versions, then check out our Patreon. The link is in the description. Uh, also, join us on Twitch. We're going to be streaming starting in February. Yeah, she got to follow us on Twitch. Yes, sir. Follow we'll us on f- Twitch. The link is below. And uh, meet us there. Follow us yeah, now. And when we get over there, we'll fire. see you. Yeah, it's going to be lit. I'm excited about that. Okay. Yeah. It's going to be really fun. All right, guys. We'll see you next time. Peace.